Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Copper Jacket TV. So today I've got some great news, especially if you live in the state of California. So we've talked a lot recently about two cases, Boland and Renna. These are two cases that challenge California's handgun roster. These are also two cases that recently got injunctions. Now, part of those injunctions were stayed. The one thing that is still enjoined currently is the micro stamping provision. Now, we have some big news moving forward, and this is going to some insider stuff that I wanted to share with you guys. So let's go ahead and talk about what's going on. This video is proud to be sponsored by American Hartford Gold. Listen, if there is one thing that those of us in the firearms community understand, it's that you cannot rely on the government for your protection, not with your life and especially not with your wealth. Look, throughout our lifetime, the dominance of the US dollar was unquestioned, but that may be changing. As we face unprecedented inflation, the world's biggest economies are ditching the dollar for the yen. Banks are failing left and right, and the government is discussing a total control of all of your money with the new digital dollar. Don't let your life savings become a casualty of failing corporations or currency wars. Now is the time to call the only precious metal dealer that I trust, American Hartford Gold. They'll show you how to protect your savings and retirement accounts by diversifying your wealth portfolio with physical gold and silver. With the finest products, amazing customer service, and a buyback commitment. American Hartford Gold has a five-star rating from thousands of reviews and an A-plus from the Better Business Bureau. American Hartford Gold supports content like this that is committed to bringing you the truth. Tell them I sent you and they'll give you up to $5,000 of free silver on your first order. So call them now. Click the link in the description or call 866-856-2507. That's 866-856-2507 or text COPPER to 65532. Again, that's 866-856-2507 or text COPPER to 655 Three, two. Okay, so let's go and talk about what's going on here. Now, Bolin and Renna are two very important cases that challenge California's roster. Now, both of these cases recently got injunctions placed against requirements of the roster, like micro stamping, uh, loaded chamber indicator, uh, magazine disconnect, and things like that. So it wasn't the roster incomplete, but it was some of the qualifying factors that are needed to get on the roster that were enjoined. Now, a stay was placed against that injunction, but only against the, mic the, uh, the loaded chamber indicator and the magazine disconnect. The micro stamping provision was left alone. That means that the micro stamping part is still enjoined. And that's why we've been seeing a couple new things here and there be added to the roster, like the 320 and some stuff from HK and Ruger. There's been some stuff that's been added recently. So with that being said, I want to tell you guys about a conversation that I had. Uh, now, I'm not allowed to say too much about what's going on here. You know, this is something that was sort of confidential. And so I have to walk around this very carefully, but basically I had a conversation with a distributor who works directly with California, that works directly with Turner's and some other places out there as well. And this person told me that in August, you are going to see some major things be added to the roster. Now I'm not allowed to say exactly what it is because of the confidential nature of the conversation, but what I can say is that it looks like finally things are gonna be added to the roster that aren't old models that are just going back on. We're talking about brand new models, things that are available right now to the rest of the country. So August could be a very, very big month for California. Now, one of the reasons why I'm really not allowed to say what it's gonna be is because they still have to pass you know, all of the different tests that California likes to put on things. So even without micro stamping, these things still have to go through California testing procedures procedures and all the paperwork and everything else that needs to happen. And so it's not a hundred percent until it passes that, you know, exact point. But at least right now, from what I understand in the testing phase are some new models that are highly sought after and, and models that people are actually going to want. Now, as somebody who was born and raised and lived in California till he was 42, I apologize for not being able to give you more information. This is one of those things where I, I sat on it for a couple days and I thought about it, whether or not I even make a video on it, because I, I'm not allowed to say what's actually in there, what's in the process or anything like that. So this was one of those kind of up in the air topics, but I, I figured it would be something that you guys might even want to hear just to 
maybe generate a little bit of excitement because August looks like it's going to be a really good month for people out there. You know, everybody wants a good option. Everybody wants a solid option. They're, they're sick of being stuck at things that are 25 years old. I mean, things that are even older than that in some cases that have been on there for decades. I mean, they just, nothing new is being added. I mean, it was a pretty big deal when the 320 was added, but uh, you know, other stuff just kind of fell by the wayside. It wasn't anything that anybody really wanted. Uh, things were kind of overpriced. And so, you know, again, that kind of led to, to having, you know, California's having a little bit of a bad taste in their mouth. And so now knowing that this is, you know, a potential for August, well, that made me pretty excited. And with that excitement, I just wanted to share with you, to share with you, you know, at least part of the conversation and some of the stuff that I know, or at least some of the stuff that I can tell you. And I'm really excited to see what happens here. You know, I'm going to keep an eye on that roster and see what happens with it every single day. Now, obviously, the ultimate goal here is to overturn the roster completely. And that's what we want to see out of Bolin. That's what we want to see out of Rena. We want the government to acknowledge the fact that that roster shouldn't exist, that the roster is unconstitutional, and that it, it, it needs to go away. It needs to go away completely because they shouldn't be allowed to tell you what you're allowed to have within that space, within the space of our Second Amendment rights. You know, they shouldn't be allowed to tell you that. California already has enough restrictions as it is. Now, California is facing some pretty big L's coming up here soon. I think that we're going to see some, you know, big wins in other cases like Duncan and Miller. But it would be nice to see, you know, it would be nice to see uh, cases like Road, Rody and, uh, you know, Bolin and Renna and all of these cases end up finding that California has been doing unconstitutional things for a long time now and just overturn it all and turn California into a state that accepts the Second Amendment moving forward. So again, it was one of those things where it was questionable whether or not I even make a video about it, but I was kind of excited on the inside. I have lots of friends and family that still live there and uh, it's frustrating. It's, uh, the roster is one of the most frustrating things in California. So just knowing that that good news is on the horizon, I figured would be good enough to uh, let you guys know about. So anyway, I hope that uh, you know gets you guys a little bit excited. Maybe check the websites every now and then, see if anything new has been added. And if anything new is added, I will try and bring it to you as quickly as possible because in California, it's been decades, decades since we've seen anything good. So anyway, I want to thank you all very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Please like, subscribe. You guys have a great day.